Welcome to the Heavy Spoilers Show, I'm your host Definition aka your friendly neighbourhood spoiler man and we have an interesting interview with Robert Downey Jr coming out in the wake of comments made by Martin Scorsese earlier in the week. Scorsese was asked what he thought of the Marvel movies recently and the world famous director had some pretty big criticisms which included the following. Honestly, the closest I can think of them, as well made as they are, with actors doing the best they can under the circumstances, is theme parks. It isn't the cinema of human beings trying to convey emotional, psychological experiences to another human being. When asked if he'd ever tried to watch them, Scorsese stated, I tried, you know, but that's not cinema. Now obviously these comments are pretty controversial and the internet has gone absolutely wild with them. Before we get into the meat of the story though, make sure you hit the subscribe button on the channel for daily breakdowns on all the latest movies, TV shows and more and drop a thumbs up because it goes a long way to making videos like this. Anyway, RDJ was asked on the Howard Stern Show what his thoughts on Scorsese's comments were and he had the following to say. ...has become the thing. It is a huge money maker. Yeah. You still enjoy doing it, yes? I'll tell you the truth. I didn't expect it to become what it became. Mm -hmm. And it is this very large multi-headed Hydra at this point. And I also, I've always had other interests and, um, according to Scorsese, it's not cinema. I got to take a look at that. You know, well, why did he say that? Because it's his opinion. And he's, but it is he's, cinema, isn't it? I mean, it plays in theaters. Yeah. Well, what did he mean by that? That it's not cinema. I appreciate his opinion because i think it's like it's like anything we need all of the different perspectives so we can come to center and move on but you what, know but, this you're but, therapy but, 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 no come on you're Why, therapized but, but wait, no, no you're being too too uh nice magnanimous it's yeah. called no really w w were you insulted when he said that it's not cinema that somehow iron man isn't cinema it no. is cinema to me well i mean look it is, it'd be like saying Howard Stern isn't radio. It is. It is. It, it makes no sense. But what to was say he trying? Was he jealous of the success? Of course not. But I mean, he's Martin Scorsese. He then what makes, does he mean by it? I think he, in his view, uh, and by the way, there's a lot to be said for how these genre movies. And I was happy to be part of the problem if there is one. Right. Um, you know, uh, were uh, denigrated the 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 art the form. era the art form. Uh, cinema and by the way when you come in like a stomping beast and you eliminate the competition in such a uh demonstrative way uh you know it's it's phenomenal it is phenomenal and maybe he's upset about the you know what it is you get older you're used to cinema being a certain way can i tell you something yeah do you actually think martin scorsese is upset about marvel movies yes Yes, I do, okay. because he's the guy who's busy archiving films, and he has. A he's whole archived sense of... my dad's films, and by right. the way, I appreciate his point of view. Robin, what do you think? Well, it's he's commenting on it. Yeah, and why not? I don't know. It's kind of a knock. I mean, the the, the fact is, I don't. Were you ever nominated for an Academy Award for Iron Man? No. Don't you think that's? And, and, and be serious. Yeah. Because it's a superhero movie, they they turn their nose at the performance is excellent. Well, it's so a totally you, believable character. Well, I'm so glad you brought this up because there was some talk about it. And I said, let's, let's not. And because I'm much more like you than you might really want to, uh, to believe. I listen to the show. I agree with most all of your opinions varied though they may be. Occasionally you'll go on some, on some, you know, tributary trail of thought that I go like, God, oh, that's not how I see it. But I go, but I love the... Okay, so that's the full clip, and I think that Downey takes a very dignified response to the comments, and it's quite respectful towards Scorsese. Now, this is obviously because of the director's body of work, and it's difficult to argue with someone of his stature about the state of film when he's been so influential in the genre. However, I do agree a lot with what RDJ is saying, in that I feel like people in the industry feel quite jealous of Marvel's success, and even earlier this week we had Jennifer Aniston say that they'd ruined cinema. Yeah, cause along came Polly did wonders for the movie industry, didn't it, Jen? Yeah. Anyway, every time a comment like this pops up by an elder person, I'm kind of reminded of things that people said when I was growing up, which is that comic books weren't art. Now, as I've gotten older, the medium has changed a lot, and there's so much respect in general for comic books at the moment that it's very difficult to refute that they aren't art. 
Now, of course, Scorsese is entitled to his opinion, but I think the general reaction is that he is wrong and that they are indeed films and that movie making in general has changed to go with the times. Of course, Scorsese is a genius, but even things like his upcoming project, The Irishman, which features a lot of de-aging, owes something to the technologies developed by the MCU. Another thing is that Scorsese was asked about Marvel movies in general, and to the uninitiated, I'm sure all comic book movies get lumped in with them, so perhaps someone asked what he thought of those Marvel movies, and his mind went to more lackluster entries such as The Amazing Spider-Man, Dark Phoenix, stuff like that, rather than the MCU. We just don't know, but Kevin Feige had some words on the statement as well, saying the following. Maybe it's easy to dismiss the VFX or flying people or spaceships or billion dollar grosses. I think it is easy to say that when you've already been awarded in a certain way. Alfred Hitchcock never won Best Director, so it's very nice, but it doesn't mean everything. I would much rather be in a room full of engaged fans. Which yeah, I, I feel like that's a perfect comment. Now obviously I'd love to hear your thoughts on these statements and if you agree with Martin Scorsese or think that the Marvel movies are cinema. Comment below and let me know and if you want to see a breakdown of a comic book film that Scorsese might approve of, then make sure you check out my run through of all the evidence that points towards who Joker's real father is. This is the digital DNA test and it's definitely worth checking out if you want to know more. If you want to come chat to me on Twitter then make sure you follow me at DefinitionYT and if you want to join my Discord then make sure you click the link in the description below. We've got an awesome community that's made up of people just like you and it's the best way to stay up to date with the channel, so hopefully I see you over there after this. Also just want to let you know that I'm currently giving away a free copy of Spider-Man Far From Home on Blu-ray and all you have to do to be in with a chance of winning is to like this video, make sure that you subscribe to the channel and leave your thoughts on Gemini Man in the comments section below. The winner will be chosen at random on October the 15th and the Blu-ray will be shipped out from then to whoever gets the prize, so best of luck to everyone who takes part. This is a channel for people who are super into superheroes, so if that's the kind of thing you like, hit subscribe. Thanks again for taking the time to watch this. I've been Definition, you've been the best, and I'll see you next time. Take care, peace.